Judging by the clouds, we better do this inside. But that's right, it is July 7, 2023, so it has been exactly one year since we put our angle iron test piece up on top of the heavy Chevy. And there she is. Why don't we take her in and take a look at what we got. So I'm working on the 71 Chevy, getting it ready to, well, well, hello there. Doesn't like thunder too much. Uh, getting ready to prime it. And I soaked the hood, hood hinges in citric acid. And when you hose them off, this is what, this is what you get, you know. Um, so those turned out really well. So I'm going to uh, just coat them with zincit, which I've done on this one. So that's what we're looking like there, and then eventually it will turn into a nice galvanized look. So sorry, this is a little wet, so it looks a little splotchy right now. But if you remember, we had this, this half was all media blasted, and then I uh, used a wire wheel and I used a sander. So three quarters of this are our CRC Zincit product, and the last quarter is Rust-Oleum Automotive Primer. And I gotta say, I'm actually impressed with everything. Now, we've had some very strong wind the last few weeks with thunderstorms. I'm talking 70, 80, 90 mile an hour storm fronts, or winds coming through with the storm. So the other day I found this laying in the grass. It had blown off. I mean, this thing has sat for a year, but the other day it blew off the top of that cab and this end was pretty much in the ground. So I think that's where a lot of this comes from right there in the primer. But you can see kind of the whole length of the primer section. We're getting little spots of rust through. I am very impressed with two coats of Rust-Oleum Spray Rattle Can Primer, how that has turned out. Now, as far as the zinc it, apparently it doesn't matter what media you use to clean the rust. All of it looks great. Um, just, it looks like an old galvanized piece. What can I say? So, very impressed. Um... It's been out there with everything the Kansas, the prairie weather can throw at it. Thunderstorms, drought, extreme heat, very, uh, you know, zero degree temperatures, hail, snow, ice, basically any form of moisture and lack of moisture. So, including dust storms, you know. So, um, not at all afraid to use it. In fact, I'm quite impressed with it. Uh... Still, if you're looking for a shiny coating like they show on the pictures, don't bother. You're not going to get it. Um, but you do get this beautiful gray galvanized look. So there you go. One year. Um, I don't know. I can th put it back up there. It's not hurting anything until I move the truck. So from this point, if I need to do a two-year update, probably won't do another half a year, but uh, I'll just put it back up there, see what you guys want, and uh, we can do this in another year. doesn't hurt my feelings. So there you are. Thanks for watching. God bless. Bye-bye.